Hi children, welcome to class. Today we will learn coordinates. We will learn to recognize x-axis, y-axis and origin. We will also learn to mark coordinates. Before we start our lesson, let's see what is a Cartesian plane. A Cartesian plane is a graph with two axes. One is called the x-axis and the other one is y-axis. The x-axis is also known as a horizontal axis and y-axis is also known as a vertical axis. These two axes are perpendicular to each other. The intersection point of the x-axis and y-axis is called origin. Now, look at this map on a Cartesian plane. It shows the places of interest in a few districts. The horizontal axis here is x-axis and the vertical axis here is y-axis. To write a coordinate, write the coordinate of x-axis followed by the y-axis. Now let's see how to write coordinates. The coordinates of Idaman Beach, which is at the origin, is written as 0, 0. Look at Sejinjang Waterfall. Okay, it lies on the x-axis. That means the coordinate of y is 0. Then, look at the x-axis. So Jinjiang Waterfalls is located at coordinate of 4. Write the coordinate of x, then y. So the coordinate of Sejinjang Waterfall is 4, 0. Now look at Hillview Temple. Okay, write the coordinate of x, then coordinate of y. The coordinate of Hillview Temple is 3, y. Now look at Timun Lake. Timun Lake is 4 units to the east and 5 units to the north of the origin. So the coordinates of Timun Lake is written as 4, 5. Now look at this example. The picture shows the position of 5 ferries at a harbour. Which ferry is at the coordinate of 2, 6? Now, the coordinate given is 2, 6. That means x is 2 and y is 6. Look at x axis. Look for 2. From 2, move up until y is 6. So, ferry P is at 2, 6. Now, what ferry is at 4, 0? Look at x axis. And look for 4. Y is equals to 0, that means the ferry lies on the x axis. Ferry T is at 4, 0. Now, what ferry is at 5, 4? X axis is equals to 5 and Y axis equals to 4. Okay, from the X axis 5, move up until Y is 4. So, ferry Q is at 5, 4. Now, let's see how to mark coordinates of points. Okay, let's mark the coordinate of P at 4, 2. From the origin, move 4 units to the right. Then, from the location, move 2 units up and mark point P. Okay, and write the coordinate of P, 4, 2. Okay, mark the coordinate of Q at 0, 5. Okay, again, from the origin, 
okay as you can see x is zero so that means you don't have to move to the right okay so from the origin move five units up okay y is five so move five units up okay mark the point q write the coordinate of q zero five Okay, class, that's all for today. Till we meet again. Bye.